Glenn's ice fishing right here. Well, we want to get the camera under the water. You can't monitor what this camera sees, but hopefully it comes out. The ice is shaking. I can feel the vibration. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and I'm going to step back. One of the main concerns that we have is all being clustered up in the same area. Ice can tend to split and fracture. If Sim were to go in, you've got a throw rope to pull him out. Unfortunately for Glennon, my priority is my camera guys. It's a little thin. I can feel it in my feet. Blow off the crack at oh, my feet. It can all just cave in at once. Actually, that's holding us up. Awesome. There you go. That's how we get underwater shots. Snow machining and shooting. This is what happens. One of the hardest things about getting footage of Andy on his dog sled is keeping up with him to get the shot. So the river's barely frozen enough. It's pretty sketchy. You hear lots of cracking and ice breaking under you. Very scary situation on a, on a river that's only been frozen for less than 36 hours. So to support the way of the snow machines, we stayed on the banks. It's a safe way to travel around here. Up the hill, we got us done. 